Hey friends and welcome back to my channel. My name is Annalise and today's video is very exciting because we are doing a very glam Princess Polly haul. So Princess Polly is a really popular Australia brand. Literally all of my friends shop there. So I thought it would be fun for today's video if I went onto their website and picked out some of the girliest and most extra items I could find to share with you guys. So I am very lucky to have Princess Polly be the sponsor of today's video. As such, I do have a coupon code for you guys. So when checking out at Princess Polly, be sure to use the code Annalise20. That way you'll get 20% off your purchase. So without further ado, I mean, let's get into this haul because sitting next to me, I have some very sparkly, feathery, meshy items that I am very excited to try on. Let's kick off this haul with a very girly item and honestly, one of my favorite items in this entire haul because it is this pink sequin dress. Isn't it amazing? So it is just covered in sequins. It is my favorite color of all pink and it even has as the straps these little ties. So the ties come undone and you can just tie them up in little bows which I think makes it look just that little bit more girly and also it means that the straps are adjustable so that you know sometimes you might fit a certain size. For example I wear a size 6 but sometimes the straps are too tight on me so I really like when they're adjustable like this and it also has some ruching down the side here that again has the tie up so that way you can make it as high up on your leg as you want or as low as you want as well depending on what you prefer. Now some of you might know that my 21st birthday is actually coming up. It's not until April but you know your girl has to start planning her outfits and honestly I really think that this is a contender. It's just such a girly and show-stopping piece that I love. It's kind of like a modern day take on the iconic Paris Hilton silver dress just in a pink style and a little bit different. So I really like this. I am so excited to try it on. Is this going to be my 21st birthday dress? We shall see. All right. This is what the gorgeous pink sequin dress looks like on. So this is the front and this is the back and I am so in love with this pink dress. I really like how customizable it is in the fact that you can make this dress really long or really short like I have here and how you can make this part like droop down low or up really tight depending on what you prefer. So as I said I am wearing this dress on the shorter side just because that is what I prefer but if we do a side by side you'll be able to see that you can wear this dress super long as well which makes this versatile and kind of turns it into two dresses because these two right here look like two completely different outfits if you ask me so that is really great and means that you'll be able to get a lot more wears out of the one dress. It is pretty comfortable for a sequin dress which is really good because sometimes they can be really itchy all over but because they have that lining on the inside it's not an issue which is great. So I love how this looks on. I seriously think it is just beautiful and is the perfect birthday dress. So it's definitely definitely a contender for my 21st birthday because I just think it is so glamorous, so Barbie-esque and I love it. It's just so so beautiful. All right the next item that we have here today is very classy, very glamorous yet still that little bit extra and this is the top. So it is a champagne satin top that has some champagne colored feathers down the bottom and I fell in love with this top when I saw it online. It is the perfect top to wear when you're trying to dress up something because this would be great on a night out or you could even wear it dressed down a little bit because if you were to pair this just with some jeans and sneakers, it would still look super cute as it would with a skirt and high heels. So it isn't double lined, but they have used a nice thick satin. That way it's not see-through and it just is so nicely made. Why don't we go try it on together and see how it fits and see what it looks like on. This is what the feather champagne top looks like on. So this is the front and this is the back. And isn't this outfit beautiful? I have paired it with a white midi length skirt. Would you call this midi or mini? Not too sure. But I think that these two together look 
so beautiful because it is just such an easy classy looking outfit when in reality all you're wearing is a white skirt and a satin top because these sort of satin tops are really on trend right now everyone has one and they're quite an easy go-to top so I think that adding these feathers on it just makes it that little bit more extra and classy and just that little bit more in my style this would have been a perfect New Year's Eve outfit but now it'll be a perfect dinner outfit perfect going out outfit or <laughs> anything like that. I just love this top so, so much and I'm really impressed with the quality of it. No feathers have fallen off at all while I've been wearing this, which is great because sometimes with feathery items you wear them and you literally leave a trail everywhere you've been. So I'm really glad that that's not an issue with this top. Next up we have a top that is this beautiful lavender color. So it is a cute little knit top. It's kind of in the design of a sweater as you can see there, but it's too hot in Australia to wear sweaters. So this is the perfect compromise because I don't know about any of my other Aussie babes out there, but I get season jealousy, okay? It is summer right now in Australia, my favorite time of year, but seeing all of your guys' winter pics really makes me jealous and really makes me crave winter. But then when winter gets here, you guys are posting all of your fun summer pics and I'm craving summer. So this top is perfect to combat that because it is in the design of a cute, chunky sweater, but it's not going to melt to me. And I mean, the purple color, I don't really own many items in this color, but I really should get more because I love it. I think it is so beautiful and so flattering on any skin tone, really. So to go with this top, I actually chose a matching skirt. And this is what the skirt looks like. Just a basic white pleated skirt, because if you're a returning subscriber, you would know that I always wear my white denim skirt with everything. It would look great with that purple top but unfortunately it's shrunk I don't know how I must have done the washing wrong one day and it has shrunk so I've been on the hunt for a cute white skirt and I think that I may have finally found the one I like this because it's pleated and it just gives that extra little bit of detail it also makes it more comfortable to wear than a tight denim skirt so this will be really good to pair with a lot of items especially in this video it's gonna match with quite a few items here today so I love this it's not see-through either which you guys know is a pet peeve of mine when items are see-through so I'm really glad that it isn't and I am super excited to try this on along with the purple top because I just think it's going to be such a cute girly outfit together so let's go try it on and see how it looks isn't this outfit the cutest? I am obsessed with it. Sometimes when I come up with outfits inside my head when ordering stuff online, like buying a top and a skirt that aren't together and making it into an outfit, they don't always work out. So it is always a bit of a risk. But I am so happy that this has turned out to be such a cute outfit. It is just so cute and girly and the perfect summer outfit. So this is the front and this is the back. So this skirt is perfect as I said I have been in need of a white skirt and it is just the perfect length where it's not too short but not too long because y'all know I like to wear short things so it is just perfect and I think the pleats really just add that nice detail to it and it's going to become such a staple in my wardrobe. As for this top I love it so much I was a little bit concerned since it is knit material that it would be too like thick to wear out in the heat but it is not thick at all I am not feeling hot in this top oh that rhymed hot in the top um but yeah I'm not feeling hot in this top at all so I think they've done a really good job of making this sweater idea into a cute top. Alright that is enough of the more basic items for now. I love them but this is Annalise Wood's channel. I do have to include some more glam items in here because that is what I love the most. So I have a beautiful gold sequin set because honestly what is more Annalise than sparkles really? I love them. So it is first of all this gorgeous gold crop top that has this racerback detail with the same rope as the pink dress from earlier and it is elastic which is really nice it just makes it easier to tie everything up you know and once again they have lined the inside of the shirt with a material that way it's not sequin scratching all on your skin so to go with that it also came with a matching gold skirt as you can see here so it is this beautiful gold sequin skirt that has the ruching 
stitching on the side the same as the pink sequin dress that you can pull on to make it as short as you want on the side or as long as you want. So I really love these sets. You guys know I'm obsessed with sets because you can make multiple outfits of them. Obviously these two together will look amazing but then this skirt with just a plain white top will look super cute. The top with some jeans will look super cute and I just... Oh, I dropped it. Wow, I am so clumsy, but I just love these sorts of sets. So let's go try it on and see how it looks because I am very excited to try it on. Right, this is what the two-piece set looks like on. So this is the front and this is the back and I love this so much. It is just so sparkly and so fun. So I did just look at the camera and on camera it looks like it matches my skin tone really well, but in real life I promise I am so pale that this really does not clash with my skin tone at all. So I don't know what the camera's doing there, but I promise in real life this looks so cute and I love it. It is such a cute clubbing outfit or a festival outfit, anything like that. So this is the front and this is the back. So you can um, adjust this skirt to be up really high on one side, but I just prefer it to be the one length and then have that cute little bow on the side there. Again, it's not itchy with the sequins because sometimes sequins can make you itchy, but just like the pink dress, it is not an issue, which is really good because I have been on night outs before in sequin outfits where I am like bleeding from being cut by them. So I am glad to report that that will not be an issue with this set. And I just seriously love how it looks it's so cute and you will be able to wear this on any night out I mean imagine a night out with all the lights from nightclubs and stuff reflecting off this oh it will be so cute so I love this outfit next up is another glamorous and extra outfit and it is a dress and I must say I've never seen anything like this before which is what I live for so this is is the dress. First of all, it has these amazing sleeves and then it grows it down to be a mini dress. So this is really beautiful. It's made out of all sheer material and is covered in elastic, which is great because if you're in between sizes, it means that it'll be able to stretch on you or really hug your body tight to give you that nice fitted look. Now, this dress is completely see-through. I need to address it now before people think that I'm not noticing. No, it is completely, completely completely see-through, but that is the design of it. It's designed to go over the top of a white dress, a white crop top and skirt, whatever you have, just to give that gorgeous mesh look. So I love this because it's just so different. If you were to wear this out, guaranteed no one else will have the same outfit as you unless they've watched this video. So let's go find a dress to wear underneath this and put it on. This is what the white dress looks like on. So this is the front and this is the back. So Underneath this dress, since it was completely see-through as it's meant to be, I have worn what looks like a white strapless dress, when in reality I actually don't own a white strapless dress, so I just took a long skirt that I had, it's a tight fitted long one, and I turned that into a dress to wear underneath, and I think it looks great. It's really not noticeable at all that you are wearing a dress underneath, and I think that's mainly because the whole statement of the outfit is all of the mesh, and I love it. I think it looks so cute. However, I think I'd probably wear it off the shoulder like this. You can wear it both ways, and I think both are cute, but I just prefer it this way. And then it has the little puffy sleeves on the side, which I think are so much fun. So. One thing that I was curious about when I saw this online is sometimes when you have sleeves like this, I'll put this up just so you can see, but when it's all elastic down there, sometimes it can be kind of painful, but I am happy to report that it's not. It's kind of like, it's tight enough to where it gives it the structure, but not so tight that it's like gripping on your skin, which is really good. So I think this dress is beautiful. Again, really nice to wear. Super flowy and easy, well I mean not flowy, it's a tight dress, but flowy as in I'm not like suffocating underneath all of this fabric. Since it's mesh, it's nice and breathable and I just think it is so cute, don't you guys? It's just an adorable little dress. The next item in today's video is again a very girly top. So this is what it looks like. It is just a crop top that has some beautiful lace on the sleeves and down the bottom. And I really am excited for this top. I think it's going to be a great basic because it is a super plain, easy top to wear, yet it does still have the details of the buttons, the v-neck and the lace on it as well. And also it does have buttons on it. So I am 
always one to say that you can really tell the quality of an item based on if the buttons fall off. Sometimes I order items and the buttons have already fallen off before I've even worn it. So let's pull on these buttons. There we go! I was really pulling then and it didn't fall off. So that is really good. I am really impressed with this top and I seriously cannot wait to try it on. So let's stop talking and just go put it on and see what we think. Here we have the cute little lace top on. So I paired it with the white skirt from earlier and I love this outfit. I think I look just like a tennis player who is also into fashion or maybe like, you know, a middle-aged rich mom that plays tennis and I am living for that. So. This is the front and this is the back. So I will just let you guys know that I have gone ahead and put in a little safety pin just on top here. It's actually the safety pin that was on the tag of this top just because I am smaller chested so I don't really fill out this top enough to have it that deep cut. So I just put that in there and I think it makes it perfect. So if you are bigger chested you definitely won't need to safety pin it or anything like that. It's just that I do not fill it out. Though I am really happy with this top. I was a bit concerned at first that it was going to be too short but it is just the right length to where you're not showing anything. I'm still wearing a bra underneath all this and you can't see it which is great. So I think that it fits perfectly. We are now on to the second last item in today's video and it is a pair of pink shorts. I have been on the hunt for a pair of cute pink shorts for so long because I am kind of outgrowing a lot of my old shorts. That's why I have started a Depop selling off a lot of old things just because I am not fitting my shorts like I used to. So I've been on the hunt for a nice pink pair and this looks like it will be perfect because it has the nice detailing on the top and it just doesn't look awkward. I think sometimes shorts can just look a little bit awkward if they're just like fabric and they don't have any detail on it but by having these top little details and the pleated sort of material I think that it is a beautiful pair of shorts and it also has this little tie up on the side to make a cute little bow so again just making that outfit all the more girlier and these are honestly going to be my go to lazy slash casual day outfit. These with a white top is just gorgeous every time because the pants are such a statement without drawing too much attention. So I have been really looking forward to these shorts. So let's go try them on and see how they fit. These are what the cute little pink shorts look like on. So this is the front and this is the back. And as I said, I would use these on a day-to-day -day basis just with a basic top. So that is how I have styled these because this is genuinely going to be my go-to basic outfit now because it's just so cute yet so simple. I really think having this bow detail makes it look just that little bit more cute and I am just in love with these shorts. They fit really well. Again, same with the skirt from earlier. They are the perfect mix between not being too short but not being too long, which I appreciate because there's nothing worse than falling in love with a pair of shorts and then they get there and you can't wear them because they're too short. So that is not an issue with these luckily but they're also not too long to where it looks awkward either. So they are just the perfect spot in between. And now we are on to the lucky last item in today's video and I think it is my favorite because I've actually been wearing it this entire video <laughs> because when I opened up the package I couldn't wait. I just had to try it on and see how it looks and I loved it so much that I kept it on for this video. So let me show you guys what it fully looks like. It is this beautiful red top with the two little bows and it has all this nice boning down the front here to give it some structure. So I love this top. I mean obviously I've been wearing it the entire video and it is so comfy. So this top I just thought was beautiful because not only does it fit really well but I love the bows on top here. I have seen so many tops with this sort of style floating around lately and they are always sold out in my size. So when I saw that Princess Polly had this top in my size with the bow shoulders I knew I had to try it. This is what the lucky last item looks like on and you guys are now able to see my full outfit. I should do this more often and show you what I'm wearing fully on camera because you can only see like here up with my videos. So let me know down below if you are interested in seeing my outfits that I'm wearing in the videos. But this is it today including the cute red top from Princess Polly. So this is the front and this is the back and it's just such a cute bodysuit. I've been wearing it for ages now filming all this 
this and it is pretty comfortable because it has so much boning because that's the structure of it so sometimes those can be a bit uncomfortable but luckily with this one it's not so I definitely recommend getting it in your size don't size down on this one because otherwise you might find that it's a little bit tight just because it has lots of boning but the boning is important because it keeps the shape all intact you guys know I'm always talking about boning in videos being like mm, if that doesn't have boning not very good so I'm really happy that this does have a boning I really love this top so I have tucked it into this skirt but as you can see here this is what the top actually looks like so it would look really cute with a pair of jeans or anything like that so I love this top I think it is perfect for summer perfect for V-Day actually that's coming up Valentine's Day it's a gorgeous little top to wear if you're going out on a date or doing anything cute like that or even if you're not and you're just chilling by yourself it's still a cute top to wear and with that that is the end of my princess Polly haul I really hope that you guys enjoyed it if you did be sure to use the discount code Annalise20 on Princess Polly for 20% off your order and as always all of these items will be linked down below so I do hope that you guys enjoyed this video be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel because I upload new videos every single week and if you want to see more of my face or some of these outfits in action then be sure to follow me on Instagram Pinterest and Twitter and also my vlog channel and also I do have a Depop now as I mentioned earlier where I am selling a lot of my clothes so be sure to check that out as well if you are interested all the links to everything are down below thank you again to Princess Polly for sponsoring this video and I will see you all in my next video bye Mwah.